Hello, I'm Paul Graywall, a director at Trinity Consultants. Welcome to the first in a series of videos explaining key concepts in environmental regulation. Today, we will introduce the basic elements of the PSD program. PSD stands for Prevention of Significant Deterioration. The PSD Air Quality Permitting Program was established by the U.S. Environmental Protection Agency to meet the requirements of the 1977 Clean Air Act amendments. The purpose of the PSD program is to prevent industrial expansion from degrading ambient air quality and ultimately public health and welfare, even at levels below the national ambient air quality standards. PSD is part of the Federal New Source Review Program and applies to emissions increases of a pollutants that are in attainment with the national ambient air quality standards for a given location. When an entity plans to build a major source of air emissions or make a major modification to an existing source, it must first obtain a PSD permit prior to beginning construction. PSD requires the entity to demonstrate that it will not cause or contribute to an exceedance of the national ambient air quality standards or PSD increments, and the best available control technology will be applied to each new or modified emission unit. If preliminary dispersion modeling indicates that impacts from the proposed project are above a de minimis level, then the applicant must conduct a full impact analysis, including evaluating impacts from nearby sources. Due to the complexity of these analyses and the time associated with the regulatory review process, which can range anywhere from 6 to 18 months, Many industrial facilities choose to avoid PSD by capping their emission increases below the major modification threshold levels. 